What's going on, everybody? We are back with another episode of Pokemon. So, last time we left off, we lost. We had our first L of the <laughs> of the um, you know journey. So we are back and ready to take him on, take on the gym leader. I did um, level people up or level Pokemon up <laughs> and then kind of trained off screen. So. I um, accidentally, I, I I think if you guys watched the last episode, I thought Wingull evolved at 23 for some reason. So I got, I leveled him up and then come to find out he leveled at 25. Um, so basically he has the XP share and if we beat the gym leader, even if we don't, he should evolve. I canceled his evolution just so you guys could see him evolve because, you know, figured it's the first um, evolution besides the starter. So you guys would want to see it. So I did cancel that just so you guys could see him. Um, and then Shroomish is also about to evolve. Unfortunately, he doesn't have the XP share, so he probably won't evolve, but, like, from the gym, but he should evolve pretty soon, so, yeah, he, he should be probably right after the gym. So basically, all I did was, I kind of beat some of the trainers along the way to the next, uh, next gym or next city and i think i'm going to keep doing that just so you guys don't have to watch me you know grind through all of them i'll try to you know knock out a, a significant portion of the trainers ahead of you know ahead of schedule just so i can kind of breeze through it and get to the next city and fight the gym leader and things like that so that's kind of the plan but you know as always leave your comments down below if you have any tips tricks or you know what you want to see i'm always open to it but now Let's take on this dude. If you remember last time, I got so, so close, yet so far away. He had one Pokemon left. He had the, uh, um, Man Manatrike, or how, how do you say it? I can't remember. <laughs> it's, the name is blanking me for some reason. Um, but he had his last Pokemon, which was his best. I got it down close, but I should have just attacked it instead. I tried to set up and... It didn't go over too well, then he wiped my team. But these, the first Pokemon, are easy. So this should not be too bad. I, every single time, I always I always forget, like Voltorb and... Uh, what's his Electra... something? <laughs> I cannot remember its evolution. Um, they're so fast, which it, it makes sense, but it, it just surprises me. I don't know why. Alright, two more Pokemon, and then Wingo will evolve. Electrike, and then Minitrike, I think, or something along those lines. But yeah, so what I think I'm going to do next, or after we beat this gym, kind of on to the next one, is I'll put Shroomish out until he evolves, and then I'll get Shroomish to about level 25 just so he's kind of on par with Marshomp and um, Wingle or Pelipper soon to be and then I'm going to put the XP share on uh, Electrike because I do want an Electric type just so I have some versatility because right now I have two water, a water and flying, a water and ground I guess um, and then a grass and soon to be fighting so grass and fighting so I don't have too much type coverage yet so I do want to make sure to get an electric type, you know, kind of keep that, keep that up. So Wingo will be evolving after this, which is great. Manectrike, I said it, I think I said it correctly the first time. So here we go. This is where we took the L last time. Can, <laughs> can we do it? Can we do it? All right, it boosts its attack up. See, okay, so last time I went for the Mud Slap to try to decrease its accuracy, and it just, it just wasn't worth it because I should have just kept attacking it, you know. So I feel like I'm I'm just gonna I'm just gonna put my best attacks forward, you know, just keep using Mud Shot and hopefully knock it out because I think I could have beaten it last time. And now the Troom is just higher level, even if uh, Marshawn is to get killed. I think Shroomish can come in and, and take care of things. Is he just not going to attack me? Okay. Or he's trying to go for that one shot, I guess. He might be dead. He might not even get an attack on us. Let's go. 
That grind! That off-camera grind! That's what I needed! He's gonna use a four store, super another super potion. Ah, it's so annoying, dude. You've lost. GG, move on. Come on. Oh, <laughs> I was so, so hoping. Okay. Alright, we're gonna hit him again, so unless he quick attack. Alright, we're fine. GG, we got the gym. Let's go. We just needed, you know, we need some training. We, we needed to do some off, to, off screen. So now, Wingle. So Wingle is still, or Pelipper is our highest level. So, yeah, we'll. Uh, I wanted to make sure I didn't miss anything. What? Wingle's evolving? Let's go. And boom, we got Pelipper. I I don't know why Pelipper is kind of cool to me. I, I do like how he looks. It's kind of weird that he has like that half moon in the back of his head, <laughs> but I feel like he looks a little bit better not on the uh, the sprite. I think that's what it's called. Like when you look, you know, like when you're looking at it from the Pokedex from the Pokeball. Uh, what did you give me? TM34, what is that? I assume an electric move. Shockwave, okay. Okay, that could be a good one to teach uh, Electrike. Now, I don't remember, but can you go back and fight everyone that puts their name in the Pokedex? Or Pokenev? I feel like you can. So, like, I can go back and fight the gym. Oh, we did get a bike, if you did not watch last episode. Um, we did get that. These are the people that I'm talking about. We beat... Actually, ooh, we should go heal. We beat and fought most of those um, trainers that way and to that direction. So, with that, we can kind of breeze through at least that portion. Which I, th I feel like, you know, will help things a little bit. So, now... Let's see, okay. Whoops, so we want, we want to switch, or actually, we'll level Marshnop, because I do want to, yeah, unfortunately I have to take that. Or should we just switch? Yeah, we'll just switch. I don't know, this is so confusing. I do want to, I, I want to just do one fight with Pelipper. So we'll give this to him for now, the XP share. Cause so, so the reason I'm contemplating the XP share on Shroomish is because you get more XP with the XP share. You know, so like, do I want to have Shroomish out? Mm, kind of, not really. You know, might as well just one-shot things with Pelipper and Marshnop. Probably Marshnop, because I do want to try to get him to 30 before... I, you know, I kind of want him to be my first level 30. I honestly... I thought I already fought these people. I just wanted to see if I could talk to them. But if it's a water type, I... Okay. I'm pretty, pretty sure I fought this person, but I guess not. But still, this should be easy. Pelipper. Pelipper looks really cool. <laughs> like, I like Pelipper. All right, we got Pelipper as a dog. Or should we just switch? You appear to be training properly. Everyone wants to put you in there, Pokenev. Alright, or should we just do this right now? I feel like, yeah. And then we'll put Marsh on, and then, yeah, well, sorry. That was annoying, probably. But we'll take that. We'll put on Electrike. Whoops. I feel like for some all of my Pokemon are <laughs> boys. I swear, like it does. I don't really care, <laughs> you know. It's just, um, as you guys probably saw on the first time, if you watched, I think episode three, when I before I accidentally reset my game, <laughs> um, I had a 
uh, Wingle that was a girl. So, like, I promise you, <laughs> I don't really care. I already fought them. Let me make sure. No? What? I... I think I... I thought I already fought them. I guess not. I th oh, I think I just missed out on the double battle opportunity, though. That's fine. I think I fought the one on the right. Alright. Headbutt made him flinch? Bet. We'll take it. So Shroomish... Should be evolving? Maybe next fight? And then Electric actually evolves pretty soon. That's what I kind of like about these early Pokemon is... Yeah, okay. That's what I... I fought the person on the right and wanted to set up the double battle. I don't know why I didn't go back and do that. That's... And then we'll cut the tree. That's why I came up here, just to grab that. So we'll cut that, and then be on our way. I know I fought the dude at the bottom, because he had a Butterfree and... Or not Butterfree, he had Beautifly and Dust Moth, or Dust... I can't remember the other one, the, the moth-looking one. So let's see. Attack fell. It may have some flying moves, which is going to be bad for Shroomish, so we gotta... Or just never attack us. Just keep making our attack <laughs> fall. That's annoying. Oh, my, dude. Actually, it's it's good, but yeah, I, I don't... This may not even kill it. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Alright, so the next Pokemon that we want um, is Numel. That is the next Pokemon, I think... We should be able to see one soon. I I looked up where it was, and it was like it's you can catch them at like level twenty. So I assume. Let me just make sure I fought this person. Yeah. So I assume that's soon. You know, level twenties sh like should be spawning in soon. So. So Numa will be the next one on the team. Electric was kind of a surprise. This bike is <laughs> so hard to control. Can I fight this person? No. But I can get that. Okay, good. Great ball. I'll take that. Great balls are really going to be useful until like little 40s Pokemon. Now, do I fight this person? We're already at the next city? Okay. Some of these cities are like boats away some of them are like that, that could be considered all in one city you know if, if it's really just right there all right this should be this should be shroomish's evolution so we're gonna get two evolutions in one in one episode that's great we're gonna get shroomish and wingle We may even get Electric, depending on, you know, how well things go. I doubt that one. <laughs> maybe not this episode, maybe more so next. This should be super effective, right? So I think I can just use Absorb. Oh man, I should have just used Mega Drain. I just didn't want to... I didn't want to run out of... Um, uh, attacks or PP. <laughs> Just such a weird. What is? I can't remember what it stands for. Power. I don't know. I have no idea. Honestly, couldn't even guess. But all right, Goldine. Just a bunch of level elevens. I should have just should have just kept going. But now we got twenty three, so we got Breloom coming, which is always nice. Get that evolution hopefully we'll get some fighting types and now i was i think i talked about this earlier i thought shroomish got learned i thought he learned oh please don't poison please please oh dude he may not evolve right if he's dead he won't evolve that's so annoying we need some health i know it's not very effective but it should still kill him 
Should we switch him out? I'm debating on switching it out. But I thought Shroomish learned Giga Drain um, at like level 25, but it, that's in the newer Pokemon. I don't believe it's in this one, or at least that's not what the... Yes, we will change actually, because I, I don't want Shroomish to take some unnecessary damage. So we'll switch to Pelipper and one-shot this, this Shroomish. But I, I don't think that's... I don't think Shroomish does. I think that uh, move is taught by like a TM or move relearner or something like that so that kind of sucks because i know that that's bigger in the later in the next generation like from this from gen 4 on there's a lot of pokemon that like they'll learn they'll evolve at 23 but if you postpone them from evolving like one or two levels they learn a move much much earlier than they would normally so i that seems to be just bigger in the older pokemon or the I guess newer, not really the Gen 3, or 4 and 5. Because I definitely did remember that, and that's why I looked it up, just to double check. But in Pokemon Emerald, at least the Pokemon that I have so far, it doesn't seem like the case. So. Yeah, we'll keep, we'll just knock this team out with Pelipper. Pelipper is so cool, <laughs> I don't know why, I think he, I think he looks really cool. Alright, that that person was kind of a waste of time, but I mean they did get a uh, they were gonna get Shroomish up to Breloom, so. What? Shroomish is evolving. Here we go. To Breloom. Breloom is pretty cool. I, I always was a pretty good f big fan of Breloom. It's one of the cooler grass types that exist. You know, unfortunately, there's not that many. Yes, we do want it to learn Mac Punch. Delete a move. Yes. Um. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of Absorb. I I just want to I want to keep Stun Spore. Uh, what? Yeah. Yeah, we'll get rid of Absorb. Now that it... Ooh, did I do the right thing? I didn't even see, honestly. Okay. Phew! I... <laughs> I was... I accidentally clicked A. I was trying to look at his... Cloud of Meta Superbs. I was trying to look at his, um... What do you call it? Leaf Spore's uh, ability. There we go. Okay. As long as he has Effect Spore, I think the next move that we'll get rid of is Stun Spore. Because he has a chance, you know, to paralyze or poison the opponent already. We're already at the next town. Wow. That was quick. We may get two gym leaders. Is there a gym? I know. Is, there's not a gym at every city, if I remember correctly. Well, actually, yeah, we were just at the, the city that we first met, or fought Team Aqua. There was no, uh, there was no gym there, so yeah, there's not a gym at every, so there might not, there's not a gym at every city, so there might not be a gym here, but we'll see. What is this? Oh, uh, where you can, like, battle friends and stuff. Let's just check all these houses. Wanda? Who? Why is she important? Let's talk to Wanda. What? <laughs> Digs a tunnel. What? Oh, this is where Wally lives? Is this Wally? Oh. Yeah, right. Alright. I'd be waiting for the day you challenge me, bro. Come at me. 
Let me see your Pokemon. I'll check to see how much it likes you. It seems to want to be babe. What? I guess that tells you Pokemon's happiness, if I remember correctly. Which can evolve some Pokemon. Alright, you were not, not help at all. Okay, so now it looks like there's a cave. I hate the caves. We're gonna try. <laughs> we are gonna try our best. I may need to do this off camera and, and cheat. I did not look up the guide beforehand because I kind of wanted to try it. Um, do we need Abra? And what is she doing? Um, I don't. Okay, so it doesn't look like I need Flash. Okay, we'll, we'll try it. Oh, what is this cave called? This I, I may be able to get Numa. I may be uh, yeah, I might be able to get Numa here. I, I don't know what this cave is called. I know there there's a cave soon. I'm pretty sure fighting is super effective, right? I'm so excited. We got Yes, we got Pelipper and Breloom. Here we go. And we got Marshomp. We're already level 15 on Electric. So we can get Magnetric soon. Swampert is a little bit out of the picture because uh, Marshomp's only level, what, 26, 25? So we'll get Breloom to 25. Yeah, we'll get. Breloom to 20... Oh, I should have switched to Pelipper. We'll get Breloom to 25. Then we'll level up um, Marshtomp to probably 30. And we'll have the XP share on either Breloom... You know, kind of a combination of Breloom, Electric, and, and Pelipper. Just to keep them up with Marshtomp. Because I do want Marshtomp being kind of my main. Even though I grinded uh, Pelipper. Now, what's down this way? Alright. What? Level... Okay, this is not... I definitely don't think I can get Numa. Level 6s? You're not worth my time. That's it? Okay. Let's... We're, we're gonna go back up. Like, we're gonna go up this way. My boyfriend is there. What a weird... <laughs> That's so weird. He dug... But we have Rock Smash, I think. I haven't taught it to anybody. And I don't think Rock Smash is a move that's that good, if I remember correctly. Let me... What? Uh, oh, so we, we don't have Rock Smash yet. Okay. So, looks like we can't do that just yet. We probably get it at the next... Let's see. What? Alright. Huh? Okay, so I, I... Looks like we do need Rock Smash. Do we, we don't have it, right? Let me... We have Rock Tomb. No, okay. So, I'm guessing... I've, there's somebody I gotta talk to that I missed talking to. Uh, make it easier to visit. Okay. 
Okay, so that is, I believe, the next city I need to go to. There's something I'm missing. So I, I went this way. I think I gotta go north. I gotta go that way. I believe. Yeah. Okay. Yes, this looks like the right way. We will fight you. Okay. Okay, so I, yeah. I have to go north. Then I believe I come back there eventually. Because Rustboro is... I think that's a city I've already been to. I think that just creates like a shortcut. Oh, yeah. Yes, that was the tunnel. I've been through that tunnel before. Okay, yes. I, I'm, it's all coming back to me now. You guys are probably cringing because I did not remember that. But yes, now I remember. I remember the, the other end of the city where I went in the cave and it was a dead end. I thought, not going to lie, I thought uh, fighting was super effective on Sandshroom. That's why I didn't even attack it with Marshop. Okay, Marshop level 26. Perfect. Electric. And water gun. Uh, what? Marshdom or Swampert Lerm's Swampy Waters, or what is that move called? Alright, Electrike's leveling up pretty quick. Yes, yeah, so I got a good look at your Pokemon. Next. Like, let me go. Another double battle. I just want to see what is this. Hmm. I assume that's something I have to go. A trainer battle? What? Why are you famished? There's a <laughs> there's a town. Literally like a football throw away <laughs> like go there Numel. Ooh, okay okay he has a Numel. I'm hoping that means that I can get a Numel soon I don't think fighting is effective on grass uh, it's not it's a neutral okay but that is super effective. Perfect. Alright. So if he has Numel, hopefully that means we can get a Numel soon. Use Mega Drain on Breloom. Alright. Alright, well, I'll take it. And yeah, we'll just finish it off. I was going to possibly use Absorb, but we'll just, we'll just let Breloom take it down. All right. So let's get this. Let's talk to that dude over there. Elixir. Okay. And now I remember this dude. How's this? What do you say? Series of Pokemon battles? Yeah. That's a spirit. So are there like two places where I get to just battle a bunch of trainers? I don't remember what that tower is, but... Ooh, I think... We gotta get Talo. Hopefully it doesn't know Wing Attack or anything, because I think it's... Or we one-shot it. I think flying is double super effective against it's grass and fighting. So I think it's times four instead of like a times two super effective. So we got to remember that like flying is f flying is going to mess Breloom up. All right, so we'll take out all of these. We'll go see what that tower is all about, but we may save that. I may just do that off camera.
or just next episode. We'll see. Cause we got we got some progress. We got we got Breloom. Oh yeah, fighting is super effective against normal. Yeah, so we got Breloom, we got Pelipper, and the gym leader down. That's a it's probably our best episode yet. I know I kind of set him up, but <laughs> you know had everything ready, but still. Who's next? All right, let's take you down. Ooh, Whalmer. Whalord, Whalmer and Whalmore, Whale Lord are, they're really like just funny Pokemon. I do like them. Uh, I don't know if I will get them just because I think I've, that was always my surf Pokemon. Actually, it, it may be my surf Pokemon. But uh, I think Camp Helper learns Surf and Fly, so those will probably be two moves that I teach it. Why do these random trainers have healing things? I could just... you're gonna die. Your Pokemon are gonna get bopped. You're kidding. Look how close that is. I bet you if I went to the summary, I don't think I can. You'd need like 10 XP. Uh, Alright. How many kids do they have? Breloom is knocking these people out. Ninety-three. That's it. All right, but we got level twenty-four. Oh, Numel. Yes, we do want to switch to Marshdom. All right, I like these Numels. I hope that means I can get a Numel soon. A lot of you guys may be <laughs> like, "Why do you like Numel so much?" Well, it's not that he's one of my favorite. It's just he's one of the cooler Pokemon in camera up that I didn't use previously like when I was a kid because I, I feel like I always use the same kind of you know the same handful of Pokemon and I just I kind of want to mix it up like Electrike will be a mix, uh, per, uh, person a Pokemon to mix it up uh, Breloom, Pelipper th those are three that I did, never really used so I kind of want to you know change it up make it a little bit different All right, I hope that's the last person so we can go check out that tower. Electric level 17, only six more levels. Is trying to learn quick attack? Yes. Wow, it only had tackle. Um, we'll get rid of how. I mean, Leer will be the next, so I don't know why I was thinking about, <laughs> you know, thinking about it so much. Hopefully Electric learns an electric move soon, because with just normal moves and then Thunder Wave, it's not too much of a help. Grandma? Oh, Grandma's the final one? They send in their Gram Grams on me. All right. What? Is she like a monk? She okay. Uh, Psychic is super effective against fighting, if I remember correctly. So hopefully it doesn't use confusion, because that may be actually double. Because isn't Psychic effective on grass, if I remember? Maybe I'm just tripping on that one. All right. What does Meditate do? Attack. All right. I don't know why you did that, because you're going to be. You're going to be out unless you, oh my, why? I guess just to prolong the fight, but like, I'm going to, I'm going to kill you this turn again. 
Can it not work back to back? Or it can only work twice in a row? That's so annoying. There we go. I'm trying to waste my time, Grandma. We may have a uh, Magnetrike next, next episode. I'll go in and visit, because I think you get something. Oh, is there sun? The other... Ooh, their son's the champion? Maybe? Ooh, that might... I think that, what, increases fighting type moves, maybe? So... Let's see. That could be useful on Breloom, but we do have... Ooh, does that increase, I guess, XP, but reduces your speed? That's what it sounds like. Eh, we'll, we'll be fine. I don't want to fight that dude right now. I want to just, I want to go in here. I want to see what this is all about. This is the trainer hill where you enjoy tag battles with many trainers. Oh, okay. So I can't even go in it yet. But we can heal, right? Okay. Alright. Yeah, so now we just gotta go north to the next city. To... where is it? To this city? Lava Ridge? That sounds like a normal place. Jagged Path? I think that's where you can get new old Desert? I don't know. I'm just wishful thinking, maybe. Uh, let's look. Okay. There's a battle tent. Blue is where we haven't been. No, we've been to Duford. We've been to Slateport. We've been to Rustbro. Did we not do everything at Duford? Uh, I don't know. But nonetheless, next city I think is Lava Ridge, if I'm not mistaken. And I mean, we got a lot done. We got two evolutions. We got two Pokemon evolutions. We got Breloom now. And we got Pelipper. That's exciting. And we got that gym. We got revenge on him. So. Yeah, all in all, pretty good episode, uh, you know, if I, if I do say so myself. Um, but next time, I will probably kind of clear out some of these trainers, just like last time, and, you know, do that off screen. But, you know, thank you guys for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.